Cappy Talk Sports Update with Ngoni. Cappy Talk Sports Update with Ngoni. It's a beautiful morning to you. I am Gordon Zashim Tasso with Lettuce in Sport. Coming up, humiliating end to a successful PSG era for Kylian Mbappe as Paris Saint-Germain are knocked out of the UEFA Champions League by Borussia Dortmund. Details shortly, but first in your local sport. We start with cricket where Zimbabwe captain Sekanda Raza says they need to improve on their betting and salvage some pride in the last two matches of the five-match series against Bangladesh. Zimbabwe lost by nine wickets to Bangladesh in the third match yesterday, allowing the host to take an unassailable three new lead yeah i think a little bit of dull and gloom the look on my face is because the elephant remains in the room our batting unit has to get better a lot of the runs that are coming in the last three games have been coming from the all-rounders and the lower and the bowlers um, so the batters have to raise their hand it has been the issue for some times and i know we are working hard but it has to happen oh the only point of concern for me has to be the fact that the top five are not getting runs including myself and uh, and i think i'm the biggest culprit in these losses at the moment to, click, to basketball, newly crowned national men's champions basket hounds are excited to have won the ticket to represent the country in the African Basketball League just two years after their formation. Basket hounds coach Russell Tawanda Nemutambwe, who formed the team together with France-based national team captain Vitalis Chikoko, says that he is happy with the team's progress. We're so excited and uh, we're now even more excited because of the next stage that, that's coming up, which is our PAL. We really want to take it seriously and um, see how it goes to be a good experience for the boys, even for me as a coach, you know, coaching at a higher level like that. I'm, I'm, I'm super excited and uh, we can't wait. In international sport, we talk Champions League semi-final second leg results from last night. Borussia Dortmund became the first team to reach the Champions League final at Wembley as Mats Hamel's score second half header and them a one new win at Paris Saint-Germain in Germany to complete a two new victory on aggregate. Dortmund head coach Edin Teresic was pleased with his team's handling of Kylian Mbappe as they kept clean sheets in both games. Terzic is masterminded one of the great runs to a Champions League final. If I have to find and pick one word, it's 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 just a very proud moment uh, for us. Um, I'm very proud uh, for 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 my staff, for my team, for the club. We showed a, a very good away game uh, against a team that is so powerful up front, so quick, so mobile. We kept two clean sheets. Uh, we won won both games in the semi-final. This is um, unbelievable and outstanding. Action continues tonight as Real Madrid play Bayern Munich in with the team's level 2 all in aggregate. Ahead of the game tonight, Bayern Munich coach Thomas Tuchel was asked if the Bundesliga has risen to become a powerhouse again following the team's exploits in both the UCL and Europa League with Bayer Leverkusen. I think it's a huge boost, the fact that we have two semi-finalists and with Leverkusen almost a finalist in the Rio Europa League. It's a huge boost. So you also rely on a bit of luck in the draw. You you rely on uh, injury um, in, uh, in on a fit on a fit team. You rely on on a, on, on little decisions on the day when it's played. It's it's not done yet. We have uh, a, a semi finalist today with Dortmund and, and tomorrow with us, and uh, we want to take the next step. It's necessary to prove a point. And finally, English police officers have briefed England's black players on the threat of online racism during Euro 2024 in Germany next month. The police reassured the players that they will take seriously any abuse during the tournament. Marcus Rashford, Bukayo Saka and Jordan Sancho were targeted after missing penalties in the team's defeat at Wembley in the 2021 final. And that's your sport for this hour. Back again in the next hour with another sports update.